Founded in Phoenix, Arizona in 1994, Televerti is a purpose-driven company that accelerates the sales pipeline of startups, mid-size, and Fortune 500 companies across the globe while providing job training, education, and opportunity to incarcerated women. In 1995, Jim Hooker became CEO. After years spent in sales and technology, Jim was excited to lead a company that could provide high-tech business solutions and services while also having societal impact. I was in my 40s between, in between careers. I liked high-tech stuff. I liked sales and marketing. I ran into a guy who said he had an offer I couldn't refuse. He took me to a downtown, downtown Phoenix to an old Best Western hotel, which had been converted to a prison complete with razor wire all around it. He led me into the prison through a little sally port, port into an internal courtyard. Inside the courtyard, there was a trailer. You know, the kind of trailer you see in a shipping yard. Inside the trailer was the makings of a call center, all staffed with felons. There were five part-time callers, two part-time partners, a part-time supervisor, and a 486 PC, and no paying customers. Not a single paying customer, and I turned to him and I said, wow, this looks like a really great idea. Not only did Jim recognize a gap in sales and marketing, long before anybody else was talking about it, he also committed to support a disempowered community that was being stigmatized and ignored by society. Jim saw potential in every one of the women at Perryville, and he had a burning desire to invest in them so they could see it too. But during the early years, Televerdi struggled to overcome the stigma of conducting business from within prison walls. It is a challenge the company continues to face on an ongoing basis. When I first arrived on the scene, everybody who looked at us, looked at us in kind of a funny way, like we were aliens. The other, I think, area of challenge has been overcoming uh, perceptions that, that people who uh, find themselves under these difficult circumstances are, are, are bad people and, uh, or are people who really can't do the kinds of complex work that we have them do. And uh, we've proven year in and year out that not only do we, are we the best at what we do, but we continue to be better than our competition. Over the years, technology has continued to change and Televerti has evolved with it. Early on, it was ERP as it related to the Y2K change. Shortly after, it was the push to .com. The company then shifted focus to storage and security, which eventually led to the cloud. Televerti has always been on the front lines innovating, adapting, evolving, and dominating demand generation in the process. Today, Televerti mainly focuses on the mid to late funnel with its strong team of sales development and inside sales representatives. With the talent, knowledge, and commitment of the women at Perryville, Televerti's ROI grew as did that of their clients. Televerti has now expanded across the globe Televerti is an outsourced demand generation and sales acceleration company, and we've come to Scotland to build a multilingual, multicultural contact center to service the EMEA market. Over the years, Televerti has worked with a number of different clients, including Microsoft, Dell, SAP, and many more. Televerde has impacted Pulse Secure predominantly on the go-to-market side, obviously a very big impact. Uh, but uh, across the board in terms of its business model and its ability to give back. The way I look at Televerde is, while it's a different and separate company, uh, we call them Pulses. Uh, everybody at Pulse, all 750 of us are called Pulses. And I look at the Televerde team that represents us as Pulses first and Televerde second. Televerti is proud of the impact that it has had, not only on the bottom line of our clients, but that of the individuals who've worked here as well. People ask me why not hire candidates on the outside with a clean record. Honestly, the people outside find it difficult to learn our jobs the way we teach it and to become competitive in the job. The ladies have proven that if you motivate people, if you give them the things that they need, if you train them properly and create an environment to consume what, they're, what you're teaching them, that they will grow and adapt and achieve things that no one would have ever expected them to be able to do. 
Do I prefer hiring felons? I prefer hiring winners.